Welcome to the Miami Heat Zone podcast. I'm your host, Martel Llewellyn. Guys, we're pushing to 4,000 subscribers. If you have not yet subscribed to the channel, hit that subscribe button and thank you for all the support. So Brian Windhorst said, if you're a Bucks fan, you're paying attention to the Miami Heat tonight for a potential first round matchup. The Heat are playing better. I know deep, deep down inside, Giannis is petrified, terrified, and he does not want to play the Miami Heat. I know a lot of people are going to say, well, every single time the Bucks play the Heat, Giannis is hurt. That's not our fault. Jimmy Butler and the Miami Heat, we've been through plenty of injuries with Tyler Hero, Kyle Lowry, Victor Oladipo, and Jimmy Butler himself, Bam Adebayo, Drogic. So we can't make that excuse about injuries. But at the end of the day, think about it. If Jimmy Butler was able to absolutely torch Drew Holiday, you don't think he'll be able to do that with Damian Lillard? The Milwaukee Bucks fans have literally been going off all season about how terrible Dame's defense has been. So it's going to be very interesting to see that when Dame is being put in pick and roll situations, how Jimmy Butler and Bam Adebayo, Terry Rozier expose him. You know, now I think one of the biggest questions for the Miami Heat is, will Tyler Hero come back? Because I just think that's another weapon that we could possibly use coming off the bench. But in terms of the Milwaukee Bucks, they've definitely got worse defensively. And think about it. They have the worst coach in the NBA of Doc Rivers. Ever since he's joined this team, all he's been doing is making excuses. It's, you know, he's either blaming the bus driver who drives the team bus. He's either, you know, blaming the uh, teammates. He doesn't even know who to blame. To be honest, I don't even think he wants to be there. I don't know why he took the job. He was surprised when they even came to him about the job. So when you have a coach that's in disarray, the defense got worse. Your point guard is not the best permanent defender like how it used to be compared to Drew Holiday. I just think that this team has holes. And I honestly think that we have the best player in Bama Adebayo to guard Giannis Antetokounmpo. And I honestly think it's still going to be a great series. I just give the slight edge over the Milwaukee Bucks because I think the Miami Heat have a better all-around team compared to the Milwaukee Bucks. Yes, they have the firepower with Dame, and of course, he can always catch fire. But always remember this too. Dame has a slight history of kind of falling short in the playoffs and not always getting it done. So now with him having a proper team around him, let's see if he can get this done. But I really do put this edge over to the Miami Heat, especially how Terry Rozier is playing. We never had a player like this before, like Terry Rozier, a guy who can create his own shot, get buckets, create rim pressure. Everything just doesn't fall on Jimmy and Bam. Now, if Tyler Hero comes back, we have him as an added weapon, and now Terry Rozier. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Like, share, comment, subscribe as we continue to push to 4,000 subscribers.